Hi, I'm Anthony Gettig, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to use Punch and Roll in Twisted Wave for Mac. So we start a new Twisted Wave file, just a plain open document, and then we need to check a couple of preferences in, uh, in, the, in the preferences. So you'll go up here to Twisted Wave, Preferences, and we're looking for the Editing tab. There's General, Editing, and Devices. We're looking for the Editing tab. And in the middle is this section called Recording. Um, and you, you want to set these up before you try to punch and roll. Uh, the waveform, that is how much of the waveform do you want showing? This is totally personal preference. I have mine set to 30 seconds. Um, what we're really interested in here is the pre-roll duration when punching recording. And it could not be easier. I mean, really. Basically, this is how many seconds of audio do you want Twisted Wave to play back to you before it engages the record function and picks up where it left off, you know, effectively punching in. So I have mine set to five seconds. So when I go to punch in, it's going to play five seconds and then start recording right then. Punch in will insert audio. You really don't want to do this unless, um, I mean, I guess unless you want to. Um, most of the time, though, you're just going to be picking up where you left off, and that's what this is all about. So make sure you have these set appropriately. Maybe you want a longer time. You know, maybe you want 10 seconds there. I, I don't know. Five seconds is a good good uh, time for me. So I'm going to hit OK here, and then I need something to record. So I have decided to use the um, Twisted Wave reference manual. So we'll zoom in on, on some of this here. To, there we go. It's a little easier. So that uh, we can uh, have something to record, mess up, and punch in with. Okay? So here we go. I'm going to start the recording and start in on my narration. Introduction. The Twisted Wave Reference Manual is available both in a browsable format from the Help menu and as a... Okay. All right. So there I've, I've messed up. So I want to come in here and I'm going to pick it up from and as a... And as a Okay, so let, let's do that. I'm going to put it right at the end of, well, not too, I don't want it too close, but pretty close. At the end of that phrase and hit Command Shift R. You could also come up to Audio, Punch in Recording, but Command Shift R is the default keyboard shortcut. You can customize it if you want to. So I'm going to hit Command Shift R to punch in. The Twisted Wave Reference Manual is available both in a browsable format from the Help menu and as a printable PDF, here. What makes Twisted Wave unique is its ability to deal with very large files. You don't have to wait to... There we go. I messed up for you. Uh, so I'm going to pick it up after, after this little bit here. Very large files. After very large files. We're going to pick it up there. So I'll place the cursor there. Command-Shift-R. What makes Twisted Wave unique is its ability to deal with very large files. And you can see here, it's recording, right? So I'll stop and undo that and actually punch in for real this time. What makes Twisted Wave unique is its ability to deal with very large files. You don't have to wait until Twisted Wave has finished loading a file or applying an effect before you can start playing the result or applying another effect. So as you can see, this is our recording. I'll trim off the beginning there and, um, and also the end. Get the last little click off of there. And you can see this is our basically finished recording. You can go on and do your processing and you know any EQ or, or whatever you want to do with it now. But your raw audio is is captured. And the cool thing about punch and roll is this: you when you're done recording, you're essentially done editing. You're like ready to go, ready to continue on with your project. Um, some people like to use the click or you know like snap their fingers or use a clicker. Punch and roll is just a great way uh, for long form narrators to keep the momentum going back up five seconds keep on going and get your work recorded and uh, the quicker you get it recorded the quicker you can get it out the door and get paid so there you go that is punch and roll recording in twisted wave for mac if you like this video please uh, hit the thumbs up also please consider subscribing to the channel that would really help me out and uh, until next time take care and god bless